I mean, maybe it's just because we're taking too long, or... I don't know, we're going to quickly prioritize this. And also uh, dig this area out at a nine. Destroy that. Put another tile in. Food right now is okay. We can lower that a little bit and also change some of the jobs. So everyone can just sort of do what they need to. We'll keep that as a priority sort of eight. Just so that someone's always doing it. Oh. Power's not looking good at all at the moment, is it? Okay, we need to have someone just constantly on power generation. I think we're using too much power right now. We need to disable some things, I imagine. If we go to energy right here. Yeah, we're producing 800 right now, but that's because two people are currently on the on the bikes. We need to have something that's going to just keep producing power for us. Getting that hydrogen generator in might be the, gr the, the greatest idea right now. But we do need to have it be powered. So maybe it, we can have it down here and have it just pump from the top. Just so it's closer to us. But of course we were going to make this into our plant area, so... I think in here for now might be nice. Or we could just get that coal generator and throw it in here. We still need to get this bottom sorted out. I think for now, that coal generator might not be the world's worst idea. But I'd rather not have it in... I'd rather have it down here, to be honest. But all this contaminated water is going to make that a bit difficult. We can have it in there. Let's have it in here. Let's get the electricity hooked up. Let's get the tiles put in. Let's prioritize all of this. Uh, let's just hope we can get it done quick enough. This power is a little bit of an issue. I mean, we're trying. We really are. Power and oxygen. Yeah, they're, they're the big ones right now. We've sort of hit a bit of a snag where we're trying to produce as much algae as we can, but it's not working out very well. There are other forms of oxygen production that we can use with the uh, electrolyzer right here, but it's not amazing. Well, apparently it produces more oxygen. Oh, no, that's what's making hydrogen. Ah, okay, then. That makes a lot more sense. See, I'm surprised that makes more oxygen. Unfortunately, it does use up water, though. So it needs a liquid intake pipe. We could put one up here, I suppose. Or one down there and use the water here. So I'd just have one hanging out in here for now. It might be the best course of action. One in there, just sort of have the pipe continue upwards. Yeah, let's remove this light. And let's make ourselves that. I think this one's not producing because maximum gas pressure. Okay, I'm not sure if that's just because of the particular room that we're in. Probably is. I didn't prioritize that as well, did I? No, didn't. Of course not. No one's really going down here. I'm not sure if that's because of the... The priorities that we have set up. Oh, power as well. Yeah, more power, great. Deconstruct that. Let's disable this building here. For now. So it's using up too much power right now. We're, we're having a bit of a power out. Well, power shortage because we still need to get this oxygen generator set up. Oh, yep, oxygen's looking really bad right now. No, don't sleep. We don't need you to sleep right now. We're going to have to disable some of these buildings as well. Do these require electricity? They do. That still needs to be picked up. Anything else that we don't need? Right now, I'm going to disable this pump. Don't have that one connected anyway. This isn't connected. Shouldn't be anyway. I think that is using up power involuntarily. Ugh, it's a bad situation right now. Stop sleeping, you fools. We need more algae or, or something.
Right, let's let's get that power. Uh, we need two people just to do running. Right, you just run and you just run. Run for your lives. Get everything powered. We need it. And also we need to make sure that prioritize we prioritize creating that cable as well. Come on now, you're freaking me out. Don't do this to me. I need to take a drink. Give me water. Mm. I'm doing it at the top right here. Okay, yeah, we still need to. I'm still waiting for this power to get constructed, but nothing's being built over here. Are we blocked off or something? Can they not go through because that power switch is in the way? Let's deconstruct the power switch. I feel like that might be a thing. Well, no, no. Why would that be a thing? Because they could pass through everything else. Right, we're making more power. Oh, it's working. It's working. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, I'm feeling a little bit better about our situation. Having another one down here might also be great. Or having one over here. Yeah, let's, let's put one over there. Oh, water though. Yeah. <laughs> Water's going to be a bit of an odd one here. Look, it's a little bit of an odd setup. Not prioritizing anything again. Sort of just a staple of the series, really. Also, you know what? We really should just power, like, prioritize power. I'm not really efficiently using this prioritization system, am I? It's a little bit all over the place for me at the moment. And there are some moments when I use it, some moments when I don't. At the moment, the showers can't really be used. We've got bigger things to do right now. Otto is getting extremely stressed out. So we're just going to have to throw him onto this bed for now. Come on, you can do it. All right, there we go. Another form of oxygen generation for us. Is this all our hydrogen? Wow, we're producing a lot. Oh, I suppose, yeah, we're going to be producing a hell of a lot of hydrogen now. Which is going to inadvertently help us out. Because we do need that in order to make ourselves that hydrogen generator. Right, you know what? Let's destroy this for now. And let's just uh, cancel a lot of this stuff. Right, let's make that hydrogen generator. Let's see. If we go over here. For now, I feel like it might be a good idea just to sort of pop it up here or something. It's... We'll just put it in there where it all is. Right, you know what? Yeah, let's just do that. Right, let's make tiles along here and along here. This is going to be a big hydrogen sort of room where we, we put all of our hydrogen. Eventually, we're going to sort of pump it around. Let's dig two of these up and let's prioritize that. Probably going to need to get those at some point as well. I mean, it's not, it's not a big thing. Let's make this a priority as well. I feel like there's a few sort of priority conflictions going on. Oh, there's a lot of sick around here as well. I imagine people are not... Eating very well. You made a mess. Let's make sure we mop that all up. Who did that anyway? Dirty bastard. Now everyone's moving around in their own filth. Alright, we're a little bit low on slime. This area's looking a bit nicer. Yeah, oxygen is it's still not looking great though. But we'll be able to get rid of a lot of this hydrogen, which will give us a lot more space. Because I imagine we're, we're reaching sort of max, yeah, max gas pressure around a lot of these areas. So getting that sorted out is a big one. We get rid of all the unhealthy gas, all the terrible gas, then we'll be able to sort ourselves out. So there we go. Power is a big connector, so we need to get power all the way up here. In order to make power... Right, it will produce. So, a hydrogen generator. Let's just have a quick check right here. So, it requires hydrogen. Which, I don't know if it's going to just gather it around here. There doesn't seem to be any input area. It just says gas intake pipe. So, are we, if we go to plumbing. There is a, there's a gas pump. So, I guess we're going to have to make a pump in here. Oh, right. It's right there. Okay, I'm very silly right now. So, we can make a gas pump. Which will be right in here, although to be honest, I think it should be a bit higher up for hydrogen. Uh, yeah, it should really be. I mean, gas pipe draws in gas and runs it through the connected gas pipe. So. 
Hmm, okay. So this is just sort of the gas... The gas pump, right, okay. Gas filter. Sees one type of gas out from a mixture composition, sending it into a separate pipe. This is an interesting point. Do we want to make sure only... Like, we might be taking other... We might be taking in other kinds of gases from this room. It might be a good idea for us to just have hydrogen be accepted. That way, if we accidentally have any oxygen, there won't be any spillage or... I don't know how specific the game really is when it comes to this. I don't know if it just auto-filters it out or something. Could be mistaken, but we will probably find out. All right, let's say we got the pump right there. I'm assuming this just gets everything, which I still feel like we should have a ladder going up here. With just a, a little tile... I just feel like it should be higher up. But I don't know where to really put it. Well, we could have the... Yeah, we could have it like that. Yeah, there we go. And then that way the gas can still pass through. See if we destroy this. Uh, we'll probably need to prioritize the deconstruction of this area. Been recording for a lot longer than I was expecting here. Making ourselves a fridge around this area might also be ideal. Although it requires power, which, as we've all seen, is a bit of a... Bit of something that we don't have the, the luxury of right now. Cleaning. We need someone to just do some cleaning. Sweep. Move materials on non-critical buildings and normal priority... Tr okay. No one's just... No one's cleaning at the moment. Otto is... No, Fran. Okay, Fran, you need to get you in there. If we could have people start cleaning up right now, that would be great. No one's cleaning up. Probably because I didn't prioritize it. Yeah, maybe I forgot about that. Yeah, I don't think I... I didn't prioritize it again. Great. All right, we're going to get everything cleaned up first before we prioritize that power generation. At the moment... It, it's all right, you know, it's not it's stress vomiting right now there. Did you just vomit into our water supply? Oh, no, I guess that was from earlier. Lots of stress vomiting going on. Fran is extremely stressed out. Otto, we are a little bit better now, to be honest. So you should get out of there and just put Fran in there. I don't really like the idea of anyone going in there. I suppose Islay, I think, is stressed, yeah. Yeah, I think a lot of stress is just coming on from the contaminated water. We should... I thought I prioritized this. I didn't. Okay. I thought I did. So it's going to be a bit awkward because it's going to prioritize a lot of other things as well. But I just want to prioritize the mopping. Yeah, let's just make a lot of these other things a priority of seven for now. All right, there we go. We've mopped things up a bit. That's great. Let's go back to the mopping here. Oh, make that a priority of seven. Uh, not seven, nine. There we go. I think someone got sick again, which probably caused more issues. I love just how crazy this game gets. All right, now let's make sure we get all of this constructed up here. This is a big one. We need the power so that we can get ourselves other... Utilities in order to get rid of oxygen or get rid of the the gases and also construct us some more oxygen So right now algae inefficiency. We don't have any of it right now. That's okay So we do have another form of oxygen generation at the moment, which is okay. It's helping us out We just need to make sure we get rid of some of the terrible sort of let's just say part I'm just gonna say particulates even though it's not necessarily correct because that would just sort of be uh, you know, Like matter like, like dust basically so it's not necessarily correct, but for some reason I keep wanting to say particulates. The horrible gases, you know. We need to get rid of the horrible gases in order to lower pressure a little bit so we can have a little bit more thrown in through the electrolyzers a little bit more. Nicer. Nicer stuff. Nicer stuff and things. <laughs> you know, I'm going to just say stuff and things now. It just seems to be the best course of action. Hmm. Oh, yeah, here we go. Just just sh fire all of those bolts in the random direction of the construction. It will construct itself. Do you not worry about it. This is like Ikea, everyone. 
Although, I mean, once again, they're just sort of throwing bolts at a table and just hoping it constructs itself. It's fine. It's definitely the faults of the construction. Uh, wait, yeah. Instructions is what I wanted to say there. It's the fault of the constructions. Oh, this area is so, so bad looking. I think having ourselves that blow right there is not the best thing ever. Oh, look at all that hydrogen. Oh, this is great. Right, okay. Hopefully we will be get getting rid of a lot of it. I don't know how great this thing really is. And we have to remember, eventually we're probably going to run out of hydrogen. So let's see. We, I'm always having trouble going for it. It's plumbing. There we go. So pump right there, which will send through here. Let's make sure that is all on nine. Power as well. It probably requires power. Yep. Who would have guessed that? All right. And now we'll prioritize the lock. Probably want to get rid of that as well. I don't know if we'll make ourselves another gas pump or another hydrogen generator, but having another one up there would be great. Are we all sleeping? All right, okay. Well, at least we're in a slightly better shape than we were before. Although all that contaminated oxygen is looking a little bit spooky. All right, there we go. They're all going up there. Right, pipes have been connected. Well, some of them have. Food generation still a thing. Oh, there's more sick. Oh, yep, yeah, 100% right there on Islay and Virgil. Okay. Islay, jump on that table. You're gonna lose your minds. <laughs> we probably want to make ourselves some more mas massage tables as well. Uh. Furniture? There we go. Let's just prioritize them. For now, just because they're in an area which has oxygen, so they hopefully shouldn't just trip balls all the time. There we go. Now we're produ producing power. Right, now we're going to lower the priority of this to four, in fact. Because hopefully this will reduce. It's 800 watts. So it basically, it produces as much as what these have. It looks like you're, you've are you pissed yourself again. Great. <laughs> Good job. Right. Who do we have right here? Islay, Otto, and Virgil. Otto. Islay. Virgil. Right, there we go. Chill out on those beds. Don't you worry about it. Life's fine. Mop it all up. People are just pissing and shitting themselves. <laughs> and it's not going well. <laughs> but we're getting there. We have another form of power generation. Which should hopefully get rid of a lot of the hydrogen that we have lingering around in here. If not, then I don't know. But you know what? We're going to have space for another one in the future. So it's it's in, it's in a plan. It seems to stop it. Pump. Pump not in gas. Lashing out. Oh, shit. No, Virgil! I told you to chill out. <laughs> right. We need to stop everyone from doing it. Like, Islay, stop doing things. Otto, stop doing things. Virgil, stop. Right, there we go. Islay's on here. Otto's on this one. Hopefully. Right, move over there, buddy. There we go. Islay. Is probably lashing out. Wait, where are you, Islay? You're not dead, are you? <laughs> Don't you dare lash out there, Bubbles. We can't afford that right now. All right, here she is. There we go. Now you can just talk about each other, you know? Pamper each other. That's fine. Chill out. Oh, Fran is also looking a little bit worse for wear. Everyone is just so stressed out right now. Maybe it's the lack of showers because we haven't had one for a while. Yeah, okay. That's definitely not helping. And tired. Yeah, we're a bit low on water as well, which is a big one. Is that how much power it can store? I don't know what that really means. But we have loads of power now. That's not a problem. Yeah, power's not a problem anymore. We just need to get rid of a lot of this hydrogen. There's carbon dioxide chilling out around here that we don't need. 
So moving that further down would be ideal. We've got all of this contaminated oxygen that's just behind this barrier that we have. It's really, really creepy. If, if any of those fail, we're going to have a lot of issues. And then more stress vomiting by the looks of it. Great. Are they just vomiting while also on the beds? I really did not... O I, I really overlooked the, the potential for failure when it came to stressing them out. At least we're producing a lot more food now, so we're going to lower that. What's up? What's going on there? Right, anyway. Right. <laughs> Probably should end it for now, ladies and gentlemen. But I'm getting a bit carried away right here. Look at all this. So much going on. Nit hydrogen. I keep I think I see I think I keep saying nitrogen. Hydrogen. We are slowly removing that, I think, through our hydrogen generator. That should hopefully get sorted out any well, sometime soon. We will also need to be able to get ourselves a carbon dioxide removing. Uh, air scrubber right here, which we should probably put down in one of these areas at some point, which will give us a lot more space for oxygen, and, that's, and then eventually we're going to get rid of this and have a lot of slime to make algae, which I think we'll probably use as a backup supply of oxygen. We'll probably get rid of a lot of these and have them be constructed at a later date. At the same time, as I've stated in the past, I like the idea of making us a area for oxygen uh, creation. And then we could just have that sort of distribute oxygen around the entire map. I like the idea of that. That sounds pretty fun. Water. We also need to transfer this water into this tanker that we have right here. So that we can eventually give them the ability to wash their hands and be at sanity. Well, have them be... Well, have them be able to sanitize themselves. We need to also get a lot of this bleach stone. There's lots to do. It's very exciting. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Feel free to like, share, and subscribe with that good stuff. Follow me on Twitter. Rod updates on my channel on Twitch for live streams. I've been the, I've been the innkeeper as always. And look forward to seeing you all next time. Bye-bye.